Hey, this is Matt with Six String Country. Today we're going to be doing Choices by George Jones. It was written by Michael Curtis and Billy Yates. Um, we're going to be doing some kind of finger picking stuff on the rhythm. Um, we've got an easy strum version if you would rather do that. Uh, it's a really nice, pretty finger picking thing we got going. And for the lead, we're going to be covering a, a few basses on some pedal steel and some fiddle licks and also some really good kind of country telly or less Paul licks. Um, it's really great. Uh, the solo is pretty simple. It's kind of copies the, the intro and the outro. Um, so it's a really nice signature kind of fiddle lick. Um, it's really kind of fun to play a lot of hammer ons and pull offs and let's jump into it. This is the rhythm lesson for choices. Um, this first part of the song is mostly kind of finger picking stuff, but I'll show you an easy strum to kind of get through it. Um, and it's the same strum pattern um, that you'll use for the rest of the song, um, and it just goes through throughout. Um, so I'll show you that in just a minute, and let me just run through the chords real quick first. We're in the key of D, so we're in standard tuning, no capo. We got our normal D, so that's second fret, third fret, second fret open. It's our D. We got, we're going to have a B minor in there. I'm just going to capo it, or I'm sorry, capo, uh, bar it. Um, so we've got second fret, uh, third fret, fourth fret, fourth fret, second fret. Okay. It's our regular bar chord B minor. We have an A. All right. So we got open, second fret, second fret, second fret, open. Straight A major chord there, and then we're going to have a... a Okay, so that's uh, third fret on the sixth string, open on the second, or on fifth, second fret, fourth fret, back to D. Let's open on the fourth. And we'll walk up that again, that's second fret, third fret on the second string. Then open on the first string. And then we'll do the second fret there. So second fret, third fret. Okay. That's how we arpeggiate that. So we got. Okay, then we'll go to A. So that's open on the fifth string. Uh, second fret on the second string. Second fret on the third. And we'll arpeggiate that. Starting on the second string to third string. Back to the second string, okay? And then back to D. We'll hammer that on there. So it's that same arpeggio, open, all right? Um, now let's do some of this to tempo. Uh, we'll start with the intro. One, two, three, four. Okay, 
Now let's do uh, the first chorus. One, two, three, four. sweeter kind of a uh, tone on the neck pickup for a lot of the fiddle and pedal steel stuff. Okay. All right. So, um, yeah, let's jump into it. We're going to start on the neck pickup for this, uh, main lick, this fiddle lick here. And it's going to be similar to the solo, which we'll do in another lesson, but, uh, we'll get kind of a head start on it here at the beginning. All right. It's going to sound like this. start with a uh, kind of got these double stops you can either you can do this with your fingers if you want okay but um, I just have my pick out for this um, we got open on the fourth string there second fret on the third so we're gonna walk that up so we've got second fret on both there and then hammer on to the fourth fret there on the uh, fourth string Again. All right, this is the solo for choices. Um, we're going to be on the neck pickup, or sorry, bridge pickup for this. Um, and uh, we're going to do that kind of same lick as the intro. We're going to hammer on um, the uh, fourth string to the fourth fret, second to four, uh, while hanging over this uh, second fret of the third. Okay. And then Walk that down to open. Hammer on two to four to two on the third. Open on the four. Hammer on two to four on the third string and then slide off a of five to four to two. Back to four to two on the second string. Hammer on two to three. Okay. One, two, three, four. 